Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Today we are going to talk about theme in paragraph writing. Before I get into what a theme is, I would like to tell a little bit about paragraph writing. As we already know that paragraph comprises of three parts, a thesis statement or a topic sentence, supporting sentences and a concluding sentence. Okay, let's get back to what a theme is. A theme is basically a message which author wants to tell its two readers. It is a controlling central idea about any piece of uh, fiction. And uh, the purpose of theme is to give insight, deep insight about life uh, through written words. As we can see that theme is about the big idea. For example, friendship, trust, good versus evil. Theme is basically a significant statement which tells us about the con human condition and human nature and it tells about generalized truth about universe. The purpose of a good theme is to teach a valuable lesson about life. What we need to know is that theme is not the topic, rather it is a statement or a point of view made about the topic. It's an assertion. How we can identify a theme in any written piece is that first we need to know that theme is not explicit which means it is not explicitly stated in writing rather we need to infer it because it is stated indirectly and it is implied so when we are reading a piece of fiction we need to infer through the words that what would be the theme let's take few minutes and look at this exercise where i have given few sentences you can read it out and identify that the sentence is giving uh, the idea about what concept. I have given examples at the top and you can read the sentences. I hope you are done with the exercise as we can see that the first sentence when we read it out it tells us that it is about revenge. Because it is not stated directly in the sentence we inferred it from reading it out that when we treat mistreat somebody they can treat us in a bad way as well. That's how we inferred that it is about revenge. Similarly, when we read the second sentence, uh, we can infer that it is about courage and how we inferred it is through that uh, if we fight our fears, we can be successful. That's how we get to know that the theme of this sentence would be courage. We inferred it. Similar is the case with the last two sentences. When we read it out, we get to know that the third sentence is about jealousy and the last sentence is about dreams. We need to see what is the importance of theme. Theme actually helps the writer to stay focused and it also helps the reader to collect all the scattered impressions of the story and make a whole out of it. Uh, the purpose of theme is to communicate a tr truth about human beings how they act, how they feel, how they thought, which cannot be told through word by word truth. There are two things. One is theme and idea. Theme is basically central controlling idea and it communicates generalized impressions about life. On the other hand, idea is a point of view. It's general and theme is a specific insight which writer wants to convey to its readers. As you can see, I have given an example over here that tells you how to write generalized thematic statements. The thematic idea is courage and uh, the assertion about this uh, topic is that, that it allows people to attempt uh, difficult tasks in their lives even though the possibility of failure is very high. So we can see the statement, the first part of the statement is an assertion about the courage that it helps people or it allows people to attempt difficult tasks even though if there is a possibility of a high failure. We use uh, qualifying uh, verbs like even, because, so that, unless, which can um, support the sentence. There are few things that you need to avoid when you're writing. The first one is cliches. Cliches are overgeneralized uh, stereotypical statements which are overly used. Uh, then try not to summarize your work, try not to overgeneralize uh, your concept, try not to use absolute terms, try not to use uh, names of books. Uh, um, um, in order to summarize whatever we have gone so far is that the theme is the bigger picture 
It's about the big idea. It's a central controlling idea of any piece of fiction. And why authors use it is because they want to be focused and it gives us insight about uh, human nature, human conditions, and it uh, about how universe work. And uh, the purpose of theme is to uh, give a central idea to the readers.